I was cloned by Clonade in Canada. My model number is 0112568. What y'all gotta say now? You see him? What do you guys have to say now? This is proof that I'm a clone. My model number is 286555. So, Kid Boo. Not the Dragon Ball character, the SoundCloud rapper. You might have heard of him over the past month or two, he's been getting very popular, all because of something that he said in an interview. I wasn't gonna make a video about him because so many people already have, but the reason I am posting one is because of a new video that he posted like I think two, three days ago. And a lot of people have been getting confused over this new video that he's posted. A lot of people are believing him after watching it. But before we get into that video, let me just quickly explain what it is that he's done for the people that don't know who he is. He did an interview with DJ Vlad about a month or two ago, and he gets asked a very simple question. It's something like, where do you grow up? Or where was you born or something? And he goes on to talk about how his first gen was born in Jersey. Uh, he got cloned in Canada. I guess you originally were born in Jersey? Yeah, yeah, originally. My first gen. I'm a second gen now. My first gen was born in Jersey. However, I was cloned by Clonade in Canada. My model number is 0112568. To me, it's clear that he's trolling. He's just making this shit up. A lot of people after seeing this were like, no, but that's what they want you to think. They want you to think that he's joking. They don't want the truth to be exposed. Okay, all right. We're gonna get to that part later on in the video, but to me, it's clear that he's trolling and because it's getting him a lot of attention, he's rolling with it, which I don't blame him for because it's obviously working. So there's been a bunch of videos posted about that stuff. We're gonna be talking about this new video he posted a few days ago. He went on Instagram live and supposedly exposed his clone. What y'all gotta say now? You see him? We got the same tattoos, same hair. Same genetic structure. Here's my clone. Go ahead. What do you gotta say now? I mean, I'll wait. People really believe him because of this. Lots of pages are posting this, and if you read any of the comment sections, which I'll probably read a few later, people are like, oh, you know what? I'm starting to believe that he's actually a clone. Nah, I believe him now. How can you edit an Instagram live? Let me show you guys why this is obviously not real. Cloning yourself is easy. Okay, I mean, at least when it comes to editing. And I know this is on Instagram Live, which is what a lot of people are saying. I'll talk about that after I've explained how you actually clone yourself in a regular video, because it does tie in. When you clone yourself, you record two videos in the exact same place. The camera has to stay in the exact same position for it to work, which if you watch Kid Boo's live video, the camera never moves. You cut down half of the video, put the other one on top of it and sync it up. That's it. That's all you have to do to make it look like you're talking to yourself. You're right. Of course, you want to make sure the lighting is the exact same in both videos that you record. You want to make sure that you're looking in the exact direction where yourself is going to be in the other video. And you want to make sure that it's well edited. Um, I could have probably done all of those things a lot better in my examples, but then again, I'm not trying to actually make people think that I'm a clone. Now let's talk about Kid Boo's clone video, his Instagram live. Like I said earlier, the camera stays in the exact same position the entire time. Secondly, he, uh, he literally left no room for mistakes. He left a very large gap in between him and his clone. You know, the part where you would cut down half of the video? That gap is a lot bigger than it actually needs to be, but they never get closer to each other. They never touch each other, uh, as in like, you know, to prove that there's two physical kid boos in this world. They never get up and record with each other because it would just be a million times harder to edit. Thirdly, some of the responses that the clone gives are slightly off. We gonna go live, bro. I mean, we gonna go viral. <laughs> Go this His clone has no f***ing reaction at all. The reason is because it's super hard to remember every single thing that you said in the first video that you recorded, and it's really hard to react to them at the correct time. Because you record the first video, and then you record the second, but you're actually not reacting to someone next to you. You're reacting to nothing. You're going off of memory. You're just thinking, okay, what did I say in the first video that I recorded, and when did I say it? And then you've got to react to that and hopefully get it right. With Kid Boo's live video, you have to do it all in one take. If anyone notices a cut in the video, people are going to be like, hmm, how did he cut in an Instagram live? Oh well, I still believe him. So if you watch the video, you'll notice that his clone has either no reaction to something that he said, probably just because he forgot that he said it, or his reactions are just a little bit too early or late. What do you gotta say now? I mean, I'll wait. I'll 
Look at that. I saw that shit. His clone looked to the right. You know why? Because he forgot that he leaned over in the first video at that time. So he looks over thinking he's there, but he's actually down there leaning over. And I know you guys are probably thinking, Lewis, why are you going into so much detail? Of course he's not a clone. You'd be surprised with how many people are actually arguing that this is real. And I know that some of those people are going to try and defend this and be like, oh no, bro. The reason he didn't have a reaction when he said we're going viral is because... Clones have no emotions. Clones have no feelings. So he didn't laugh at that joke because he, he's got no... <sighs> if you believe that over my explanations, I don't know what to tell you. Now let's talk about how I think he did it on Instagram Live. Because this is one of the things that is making a lot of people believe him. The fact that it was on live, so it couldn't possibly be edited, right? Wrong. They have some sort of software which allows them to play a pre-recorded video on Instagram Live. So none of this video was actually live. The entire thing was pre-recorded and edited just like how I explained. And then they used the software to show it on Instagram Live. And when he was recording it, what he did was he acted as if he was on Instagram Live. So when they actually edited it and showed it on Live, it seemed real. That's all he did. Again, I've already shown the similarities between Kid Boo's Live clone video versus a pre-recorded clone video. Also notice how the Instagram live just starts and ends without him being anywhere close to the phone. Whatever software this man is using to broadcast his clone video on live obviously has a start broadcast and end broadcast button. Thing is though, he could have actually got up and ended the live and it still, he would have still been able to make it look real. As long as he stayed to one side of the video so he didn't actually interfere with the other side, his clone side. That's how I believe he did it on live. Surely no no one is still going to believe that he's a clone after hearing my explanations. And for the people that do still believe he's a clone, this is my question. If they were going to let him expose his clone, why would they do it in such a faked way? Why not actually shake hands with your clone? Why not actually, you know, make it look real? Now let's go on to some conspiracy theories. My thoughts on cloning. Uh, do I think it's real? I don't, I actually don't know. It's not something that I completely don't believe in, but it's not something that I am confident in saying, yeah, this definitely does exist. Exist. However, even if I did believe that cloning was real, I am very confident in saying that Kid Boo is not a clone. And secondly, my question is, what is the purpose of, like, cloning? Is it to clone someone to have control over them, to use them, or, or anything like that? And if that's the case, then why the fuck would they clone Kid Boo? Yeah, let's c clone Kid Boo so we can c control him. What would they get out of that? I'm not even mad at Kid Boo for rolling with this clone thing, because it's working for him. It's getting him a lot of attention to his music and everything else that he's doing. It's just the comments that I see about people believing it. Oh no, this is on live. This is definitely real. Oh no, they want you to think that he's joking. They want you to think that he's not being serious. No, this is edited. I was going to look at some comments from people that, you know, try and explain why this is real, but I'm not going to do that because they are actually painful to read. But anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here. Thank you all for watching and I will see you all in my next video.